The Century Media Podcast. What's up, Metal Maniacs? I'm Jason Tyler, bringing you another Century Media Road Report news in the world of all things metal. Megadeth will join forces with Testament and Exodus for a month-long jaunt that will find these thrash titans crisscrossing the nation on the Rust and Peace 20th anniversary tour. Megadeth will be playing their landmark genre-defining album, 1990's Rust in Peace, in its entirety, in addition to other Megadeth setlist favorites. Megadeth's latest in-game was released in September and received some of the highest critical accolades of the band's career. The band performed on Late Night with Jimmy Fallon and was nominated for yet another Grammy, the eighth nomination of their storied career for Head Crusher. Testament will perform their first ever album, The Legacy, in its entirety during the Rest in Peace 20th Anniversary Tour with Megadeth and Exodus. The tour will kick off on March 1st in Spokane, Washington and will run through the end of the month. The Rockstar Energy Drink Mayhem Festival 2010 lineup has been announced on the main stage will be Korn, Rob Zombie, Lamb of God, and Five Finger Death Punch. On the Mayhem Festival stage, Atreyu in this moment, Norma Jean, and Three Inches of Blood. The Jägermeister stage rounding off the bill is going to be Hatebreed, Chimera, Shadows Fall, and Winds of Plague. Rockstar Energy Drink Mayhem Festival pre-sale tickets go on sale. April 2nd and tickets go on sale to the general public on April 16th at LiveNation.com. Mayhem Fest runs July 7th through August 14th, 2010. Brutal Truth, Voivod, Black Anvil, and Black Tusk have been confirmed for the 2010 Sky on Rock Fest to be held Saturday, March 13th in Columbus, Ohio. This free event will be held across four different venues along Columbus North High Street near the Ohio State University campus. Complete festival details and RSVP information can be found via skyon.com backslash rock and admission is free with RSVP. Soilworks forthcoming 8th album will be the first to feature Peter Wickers since his return to the band in 2008 as well as the studio debut with guitarist Sylvain Kodrat from Scar. Look for the Panic broadcasts to be unleashed this fall via Nuclear Blast Records. Virginia-based Arsis have posted the brand new video clip from the song Force to Rock online. The track comes from their upcoming record Star for the Devil, set for release on Nuclear Blast Records on February 5th in Europe, February 9th in North America. Catch the band on tour now in North America on the Tyrants of Evil tour with Arch Enemy, Exodus, and Mutiny Within. Suicide Silence will take part in this summer's highly anticipated Vans Warp Tour. They will join a very diverse, impressive list of artists ranging from Andrew WK and Sum 41 to the likes of Every Time I Die, The Dillinger Escape Plan, and White Chapel, amongst many others. Suicide Silence will spend the next few weeks hold up together writing new material before embarking on a massive world tour this spring, which will see them hit territories such as Japan, East Asia, and South America for the very first time. With vocalist bassist Tom Araya now on the right track to recovery, Slayer announces the rescheduling of its UK concert trek. The dates will kick off May 26 at the O2 Academy in Leeds, with the band playing seven headline shows, ending with two in London. All tickets for the original shows are valid, and The Haunted will remain as main support on all dates. Don't forget to check out my internet radio show, Transgression Overthrown, every Friday, 2 to 4 p.m. Pacific, and Saturday, 10 to midnight Pacific, on WPMD.org. Also, check out the show's MySpace page for playlists, archives, and video documentaries, as well as ticket giveaways on the upcoming shows at MySpace.com backslash WPMD Metal. I am Jason Tyler, reminding you to keep it heavy.